All right, everybody, so real quick, we're just going to show how to make a overlay that you can use during your stream while streaming with any Tiltify campaign. So first, all you got to do is go to your dashboard. Once you've published your campaign, you just click on that. And really easily, right up here at the top, you have your overlays. From here, you can create a new overlay, or if you've already started one, you want to use a blank slate, or you can even use a default, which comes with certain things already added. From here, to make an actual donation, alert all you gotta do is add an alert box you can choose the size and how big you want it you can also adjust uh, once you first create it if you're not streaming 1920 um, but by default once you do it it'll be 1920 from here there's a few disadvantages of using tiltifies and the biggest thing is that you're limited to what's actually in Giphy now if you do want to use a GIF you can go to Giphy and actually upload your GIF however it could take up to three days or even longer for your GIF to show up in here so if you upload it just make sure that you have some lead time if you want to use a very specific one from there you can then search anything in Giphy so you can find keywords and a search and choose it for this we're just going to go really simple use the Nat Geo one the other thing is you cannot upload your own sound, instead you have to use one of the preloaded ones. So for this we're going to use a fanfare, and then, that sounds alright. And then uh, you can choose your volume, so if that was a little loud, you can also adjust your volume individually in OBS, which I'll show you in a second. You can choose your duration, so if it's a longer GIF, or if you don't, or if you have a hard time reading, you can extend it. You can also then choose the donations equal or over. This is really good, so if you want a donation that's for, let's say, right under ten dollars and you want a specific one you can then add a ten dollar one all right so now that we have this one all set up and that's equal and it'll show donations only equal or under ten dollars you wouldn't want to create one that's maybe more exciting for one that's larger than that so then we can add another alert box here we can then go to our giphy search right here and we can type in a gif you can also use stickers so if you want just like a sticker of a narwhal or whatever you're using you can also do that so maybe you have stickers for lower amounts, gifts for higher. We'll then add an applause. And then we'll show donations equal or over $10. Now the thing with this is that you have to make sure that your donations are equal or under has to be higher than this amount. So for this one, let's say you want everything. You can just type in an arbitrarily high number, save your changes, and now you can test it. You go up here and you test it. So let's say we have a regular number one for $1, sweet. And let's test a donation for $15. We send that test and boom, we have our different one. From here, all that we're gonna do is copy our overlay URL here. Go to our OBS that we're using or if you're using slobs, you can also do this. Then go to add a browser source. You're gonna name this something like Tiltify Overlay. Okay. I have your generic one. You'll now copy that URL. We said that was 1920 by 1080. This is what I was talking about where you can control the audio via OBS. So if you thought that was too loud and you want to adjust individually in your stream, just check that box. And always when setting up any type of alert box, click the shutdown source when not visible. That way if you're using multiple or if something else is going on, you don't have alerts coming from scenes that are not on. So you hit OK. So one of the downsides of using Tiltify's overlay is that you don't actually have a good way of testing it while live. You can push test donation while on their thing, it'll show it. However, it won't actually show it in OBS, so the only time that you can test it is actually when donation happens. Now, for the sake of this video, I'm going to donate $1 to the charity of my choice right now, which is the Patty Aware for this foundation. And you should see the overlay once I've gone through all the steps. And boom, there you go. It's as easy as that. If you need any additional help, I'll be posting Tiltify's official URL in the description. And you can also follow me and subscribe to me on both Twitch and YouTube at the Pi Piper, where I post additional tech support, including specifics on Tiltify and utilizing Mario Maker and stream elements. Also, if you guys are interested in any speedruns or various content, including new games and horror games, you can check me out over at Twitch or all my VODs, which are uploaded to this YouTube channel.